detain you. Detain me for what? What are you detaining me for? Because. Do y'all see this? Hey. Look at this. Hey. An ugly confrontation caught on a Sacramento police body cam showing an officer struggling with a suspect who left his car running in front of a local 7-Eleven. Tonight, that man says police overreacted by confronting him over a rarely enforced law. Good evening, I'm Tony Lopez. And I'm Adrian Moore. Now the NAACP says the arrest was racially motivated and they're calling for an independent investigation. New tonight, CBS 13's Macy Jenkins is live at the Sacramento Police Department with more on the fallout from this confrontation. Macy. Well, Adrian and Tony, Craig Williams spent nearly 24 hours behind bars after leaving his car outside of the 7-Eleven idling. Now, police say he was noncompliant and tried to resist arrest. And now body camera video shows us just how this interaction took place. Man, come on, man. Don't grab me. Don't grab me. No. Body camera video from a SAC PD officer shows Craig Williams in handcuffs Friday morning. I didn't did nothing, man. His arrest sparked by his idling car outside of 7 Eleven. It's a violation of city code. I'm come trying on, to explain man. the law to you. Come and you're on. Not... No, there is no law. But how did it go from the officer's request? ID, please. To a recitation of the law. So you have your car running. That has nothing to do with what's going on. It's a on, misdemeanor man. to leave your that car running. To, to a physical struggle in just one minute. Sir. What are you detaining me for? Four days after Craig's release from jail. I still feel kind of shocked and appalled, but just getting over it. NAACP President Betty Williams says the confrontation shows a continued pattern of brutal behavior towards black men by the Sacramento Police Department. Chief Hong, it's time for you to clean house of all the bad apples that you have inherited into your department. Williams attorney Justin Ward explained that his client was in 7-Eleven buying snacks when the officer turned off Williams' vehicle left idling outside. It looked like this officer was looking for conflict. Then the officer motioned for Williams to come outside. Call him like a little boy and say, come here. But Detective Eddie McCulley with SAC PD. The reason we put the video out is so people can see for themselves what occurred. Says Williams' arrest came down to not following the officer's request. Just no. identification. For what? I didn't break no law. Your car was I running. I didn't break no law. I'm telling you, trying to tell you that I'm you broke the law. But it's very important when an officer gives a lawful order that um, you comply with that lawful order so that the, the contact can be safe for everybody involved. The NAACP wants to see disciplinary action against the officer. He went there with the intention to racial profile him and to take a black man to jail. Now, Williams is from Sacramento and works as a chef at a local restaurant. His attorney says they're not sure if they will take legal action, but if they do file a civil suit, that will have to wait until any criminal charges are taken care of. Williams is set to appear before a judge on May 22nd. And we'll follow it. Macy, thanks.